Today, we are coming back to the Holiday Hills. This is a Flavor Bonanza. Prepare those taste palettes as we immerse those long cravings and head back to the night time. We're gonna take you on a tour or we're gonna eat for tonight. Okay, so we ordered a uh, fresh corned beef for me and then for Cham, where she's gonna have a uh, beef tapa. I think we're gonna have an ice cream later. So I'm gonna have a light meal for today. I don't know if it's light because you know, you know that the breakfast in Antonio's has a big serving. Anyway, let's wait for the food and then let's check it out. Okay, so as you can see, this is I think this is the episode two of uh, our food hall here in Tagaytay. Yeah, and maybe I'm not sure if we're gonna take, we're gonna order pizza, but maybe not because I think it's too heavy already. So yeah, and everything is good. Okay, usually here in Breakfast San Antonio, there's a lot of people, but right now, uh, look at that. I think uh, we got the restaurant for ourselves, but there's the other ones there, so. The last time we were here, we ordered smoked bacon steak. That is actually one more tasty order here in Breakfast in Antonio. Why I ordered fresh corned beef? Because I watched a meeting right yesterday about corned beef, so got interested on what real corned beef taste like because they say that the corned beef here in breakfast in Antonio is one of their best sellers so let's wait for that Fresh corned beef of breakfast and Antonio's and the beef tapa. So I'm gonna taste each so at least uh, I can have a comment for uh, each one of the dish. So let's try this first, okay? Okay, so I have the uh, corned beef here. I have the tapa because you know I have to taste it, and this is the tapa. Okay, so we have here the uh, corned beef, and what else? This is the uh, tapa. Well, uh, Chan gave me her tapa, but this is the tapa. So, we're gonna start tasting it now. So, we're gonna try this with the mustard. I'm not sure, it looks like a mustard, so. Corn beef with mustard. Mmm, okay. Uh, this, this one I like. Actually, this one is also okay, but for my taste, this is better. This uh, mustard one. Let's try both. Okay. Let's try both. Mm, okay. Both complements with each other. So, as you can see, how tender the corned beef is. Wow. Look at that. And then you put it here. Wow. Bon appetit. Mm, wow. And bread. We put some rice in it. Mm, wow. Very good. Okay, for, for the tapa. 
Okay, I already tasted the tapa before, but I want to remember on how this one tastes. Wow. Well seasoned, well marinated. Wow. This is the tapa, the champ. Then there's this garlic. Ah, wow. You need to add the garlic. Because, uh, yeah, look at that. Look at the garlic. Add the garlic here. With the rice. And some egg. Mmm. Wow. Okay, so I almost forgot about this pork and beans. Yeah, look at that. What is that? Mm. Sweet and flavorful. Wow. Pork and beef is also good. Wow. Mm. Wow. Okay, so we're gonna taste the ice cream. This is the Rocky Road, so we're just gonna try this one. Mm. Wow. This is rich and thick. Mm, really, really chocolate. Wow. Like, there's an intense chocolate flavor in it. Wow. Well, through her words, because this is her ice cream, it's definitely a 10 out of 10. I also ordered my own ice cream because you know. Oh wow. Mm. This is the caramel macchiato. Mm, wow. Coffee ish. Sweet. Very, very flavorful. And thick. And rich. Don't forget that rich. Wow. This is good. Mm. So we're here in the bakery section of breakfast at Antonio's. Look at this. They, they have this uh, huge block of chocolate here. And there's a white, there's a milk. I think this is the dark chocolate. This is pistachio? This is green. I don't know. So we tried the salted caramel cheesecake. And yeah, we're going to try it in the car as we go home. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so we are now back in the car. So let's try this salted caramel cheesecake. Okay. Mm. Wow. Oh. Wow. It just melts in your mouth. And the cheesecake itself, this one. Wow, it's is creamy very rich and wow it's just well balanced this is good this is recommended uh, maybe after you eat here in uh, breakfast in Antonio's or if you want to send in some pasalubong yeah this is great this is definitely a must try yeah 
We are now heading home, so we would like to thank uh, Breakfast at Antonio's for accommodating us. This is not a sponsored, so we still paid for our food. So yeah, I just wanted to share to you my experience here in Breakfast at Antonio's, and I hope you enjoy our vlog for today. So till the next Tagaytay Food Hall vlog. See you guys.